Hi, welcome to Take Tips and Take Stuff. My name is Ron, and I want to wish everyone a Happy New Year. It's good to be back. And uh, today we're doing a glitch effect in Vegas Pro 18. Now, if you're new to this channel, please subscribe for more tutorials like this. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much. You're like my best friends. Okay, so here we have some video footage I took 4 o'clock in the morning of the Century Bridge Lions. 4K footage. I have to cut the quality down so uh, the preview mode will actually not lag. So let's get right into this. So let's right click. I'm going to go slow here. Because we're having, some people are really complaining that they're having a hard time making this effect work. And I think what's happening is they're skipping a step and you cannot skip any step here. So let's duplicate this track. Right click. Insert video track. Media generators. Select like test pattern. It's like SMTP bars and TSC. So you get the first track. Now in your video packs, go to TV simulator. It's like reset to none. Try to get the first track. And you can set to zero. Okay, you're following along with me, guys. Okay. Now, in the compositing mode, for the first track, select custom. Select Vegas displacement map. If you're using an old version of Vegas, like Sony Vegas, it's going to say Sony Vegas displacement map. Click OK. And here, I don't want any vertical. Adjustments here. I want it all horizontal. You can go wild, or you can go conservative. So we just go a little conservative. We want just a little glitch, not a real big glitch. Right there is good. Now, edge pixel handling. Wrap pixels around. Alpha channel scales RGB channels. Make sure that's checked. Good. Now I'm going to properties. And the three uh, sco the stereoscopic 3D mode select anaglyphic red cyan. Okay. And go to the video effects. Type in stereoscopic 3D. So just type in stereo. It's going to search for it. So click on this. And drag this to the second track. Just move it a bit. It's gonna, this is going to adjust your RGB. You can go conservative or wild, whatever you prefer. We'll go a little conservative. A little glitch in there. Now, this is going to affect your contrast, or your, sorry, your saturation. It's going to desaturate your video. So then they'll try to bump up your contrast. So let's make it a little bigger so you can see what we're doing. Shrink is down. Oh, that's good. Copy these. Control V, paste them. Paste it. Let's spread these out a bit. Now, let's mute the third track. Okay, now I have to split these here. So highlight the second track. At uh, the beginning of these little bars here, hit the S key and split these on both sides. Uh, hold the control key down. Highlight these non Useful clips and delete them. So unmute this. Now you play it back something like this. Glitches. Just add a sound effect in there and it'll look pretty good. So the desaturation now 
Let's go to contrast and just video effects, contrast, and brightness and contrast. Drag this uh, default one, the third track, and just bump up your contrast to, to whatever you like. There's, there's not much color in this video here, anyways. So that's all I have to do to create a glitch effect in Vegas Pro 18. We'll work right back to Vegas Pro, or yes, Vegas Pro 13 as well. We'll still work with Vegas Pro 13. If you found this video helpful in any way, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and as always, Thank you for watching.